Hey everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Today we're going to be branching off into a different section of this map. And we're going to be working on a desert oasis. If you guys don't know what that is, I'm going to pop an image on the screen. So you guys get a basic idea of what we're going to be trying to achieve in the next few episodes of this desert oasis project. Now we're going to be stepping away from the mountain town project that we currently are still working on, of course. But it's time to kind of branch off and do some other things. And we'll eventually work on other projects and finish other projects as well. Last episode so was the world tour so if you guys have missed that the link is down below in the description make sure you go ahead and check it out and by the way thank you again for all the amazing support everyone has been leaving on this series i really do appreciate it so if we can go for 100 likes one more time that would be absolutely amazing and let's get started because today this project isn't going to finish itself in one episode so we're going to have to start working a lot today so i'm going to show you guys around we actually found this village in the last episode um and this is kind of where i got my inspiration because i never really built in a desert biome uh plus never really actually built near a jungle as well so this is going to be a great area to kind of explore and try some different things because this has never been done for me ever on a survival let's play so i'm really excited so first thing i want to show you guys is as you guys can tell uh many of the buildings here do not have roofs so if you guys haven't seen in the last episode and if you guys haven't seen any desert village biomes hopefully you did but if you haven't a lot of them have actual roofs on it um and for me a desert biome i don't really think there's needed uh to have roofs on the homes because it doesn't rain as much uh, so I figured we're gonna go with flat roofs and that's gonna be the theme for the desert oasis And that's what I did. I pretty much cut off a lot of the roofs off the building Especially this one. This one has just been recently cut off um, off screen and over here, as you guys can see, this one's been kind of transformed slightly off screen. I've been working on it just to get an idea about what we're going to do today so you guys can get a visual representation of what I want this place to look like. But this is kind of how it's going to look. We're going to have a really awesome uh, oasis. A lot of, uh, um, I guess if you guys don't know really, the oasis is going to have a lot of areas of just uh, uh, plants growing and everything in the biome where there's just a lot of green stuff while surrounding you is just a lot of desert. So that's the whole plan. So today we're going to grab our stuff. We have a lot of things here. A lot of it is going to be uh, we're going to try to implement most of it. First thing I want to work on is the farms. Uh, as you can see, I don't want to leave them that basic. I have an idea from some uh, inspiration I found online, and I really want to go ahead and try it and see what you guys have to think about it. So that's what we're going to go and do right now. I just want to make sure we grab everything we need. I'm going to grab some food with us. We're a little bit low on food as well, so let's go eat up. The great thing is we do have plenty of villagers around here, so we're definitely going to have to enclose this area um, as soon as possible so that they don't get attacked. But that's why I brought a bed with me so it doesn't turn night while we're building um, and we have them already cropping so that's pretty good all right so uh, first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna try to make this where it's kind of uh, enclosed by a fence and that's gonna be for all the uh, farms so all the farms are gonna have a really tall fence on the top of it you're gonna have the jungle leaves kind of uh, falling down and you guys are gonna see how it's gonna look uh, this is the first time I'm trying it so it's gonna be something I'm definitely gonna be learning along the ways I want to see if I have any extra dirt around here we're just, yeah there we go perfect so let's go ahead and try this. It's going to be at least, I think, five fences tall. So that's three, four. No, four is more than enough. We're going to go with four fences tall, and that's going to be the plan. And we'll see how this looks. Uh, it's definitely going to be the start. How many was this? Three. It's perfect there we go it's definitely gonna be the start to how i want this place to look and after that we're gonna start working on that building as well we're not gonna be able to get through everything in one episode but you guys are gonna get a taste for what this place is gonna look at like um and i really am excited for this project because i've never built a desert oasis uh, and it's something I actually really am interested in doing and trying to develop my skills because desert kind of building in the desert isn't really easy and this is something I want to get a little bit better at so I'm pretty happy so far how this is going to look so now what we're going to do is we are just going to go from the top and just put fences as well. I put gates. I was thinking of putting gates, and I was thinking of maybe... Let me see how this looks, actually. I don't think I can. Uh, we'll just go with fences alongside. So we're just going to add all the fences uh, on all sides of this area, so this enclosure. And then we're going to add the jungle leaves from the jungle biome we got there. I'm going to try to work with jungle wood, and jung we're going to make some like custom uh, trees as well, which is something I want to work on as well, which is something to try to improve on, which is building custom trees. That's definitely what we're going to work on in this oasis. Uh, and I think it's going to be something really cool. So let's go ahead and take down the dirt blocks here so you guys can get a better idea. So now the top here 
is going to be mostly covered in fences and uh, leaves. So we're going to continue to finish off this section. And definitely the, the uh, desert oasis is going to get a lot of glowstone and lights around here, which is what I do not have with me. So eventually that's something we will be uh, adding along the way. So let's go ahead and jump to the top. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to place kind of random... Uh, I guess random fence posts around here now where I have these dirt blocks forget about them don't worry they're just gonna be here for temporary use uh, just so I can place Oh, I don't think I can place it all right so I'm just gonna have to uh, no I think I should be able there we go so I'm just gonna place these randomly uh, along here so that on the top you have a few fences and a few uh, fence po or a few fences and uh, a few leaves as well that we're gonna kind of cover this whole top area now it does make sense to have it like exposed to the sun so things can grow but i think it would look kind of cool just to have something look a little bit different and i've seen this a few times done by uh some like examples i've seen on uh, the actual google images of places like uh like a desert oasis and it looks really cool so that's what i'm trying here to to inspire this build and you guys are gonna see how it's gonna look now hopefully we can get this done and also go off and branch into working on that building i'm gonna do both hopefully in today's episode and if not I'm definitely going to try and work on it more in the next episode. This is going to be a long episode, uh, I guess, build. Um, I guess long series. A long few episodes of working on the Oasis here. That's kind of what I was trying to say. But that's the plan right here. All right, let's go ahead and keep working here. And all the dirt blocks you see will be removed. Um, and we're going to have leaves kind of covering around here. So it should look kind of cool. All right. And let's just keep going. I'm going to try to place a good amount, actually, now I think about it. Because... I don't want too many leaves around here at all times. So a few dirt blocks here would be fine. Put one over here. And that should be good enough. I don't think we need any more. Put, put one right over here as well. And that's good enough, I think. So now what we're going to do is we are going to remove... Let me let me see what can I add here. Let's pr probably add one right there. So now we're going to remove all, all the villagers. Like, what's going on? But yeah, we're going to remove all the dirt here. We're probably going to have to fix this corner a bit more. Probably put uh, a few more fence posts around here. Probably one right there, and that's good enough. So now we're going to go ahead and get the jungle leaves, and we're going to go and place all the jungle leaves uh, where there would be like a little gap, as you guys can see. So it would be like a little space right here. That's where the jungle leaves go in, and it looks really cool. So far, you guys are going to see how it looks uh, when it's all done. Hopefully, we have enough. Uh, I'm hoping we do. If not, we'll just go off to the jungle and get some more or just finish it off in another episode. But you guys are going to see how this is all supposed to look. Obviously, I might even keep some of the dirt as well uh i have not thought that through too much i didn't really think i would be using any dirt i thought it was just gonna be leaves but the dirt doesn't look half bad either so i'll see actually potentially there could be uh dirt as well but I, that doesn't make sense so i think we're gonna remove it and have just leaves here uh so after we fill in the first kind of layer of leaves we're gonna go ahead and remove all the dirt um, and definitely, if you guys try and do this yourselves on your own survival world, definitely tweet at me your uh, kind of like replication of this. That will be something I'd really love to see. And uh, definitely, I will check it out on Twitter. So I have all the links down below in the description. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Uh, also, August 11th, we do have the official release for the Den MC, which is my server that I own. And we actually did merge with another server. They got to join us. So we're really excited to have them alongside us. And they have some great plans. They're going to be doing a lot of cool Star Wars theme as well on the on the den so we're really looking forward to that uh but yeah that's just enough about that this is a little plug but there you go you can go ahead and check that out down below in the description and yeah so it's open august uh august 11th which is this coming friday so stay tuned for that i'll probably have a trailer for all of you up there as well who are interested so there we go this is like the whole top of it now i'm gonna go ahead and add some more leaves kind of around here oh it's turning night so definitely we're gonna go ahead and get some rest because we don't want to work here during the night because of all the mobs that come out at night especially the desert bombs my opinion they're the most intense uh so let's go ahead and get some rest but look how that looks that looks absolutely fantastic we're still not done we still have a few things to do but so far you guys probably get the picture of it and it's looking fantastic and it's we still have a lot to do so uh we're doing a lot of progress and it's great to see that so we're gonna go back now we're gonna do a little bit more detailing because i don't want to leave it just so barren like this um, now what we're gonna do is I do like how this looks I really like it. so let's go ahead and grab all the dirt here that we dropped 
We don't want the villagers getting upset about that. And it's really nice to have all the villagers here. This is a lot of villagers in this town. And we're going to make sure we keep them safe as well as much as possible. So there's a few other things I want to add, which is something to make this just not look too simple like this. So let me go see what, what stuff I gathered here. Uh, I think we're going to use some trap doors. I think I have some trap doors around here. Uh, there we go. A few trap doors. A few. Uh, let's go with some. Oh, let's get actually everything I want to get with me right now. So that we can actually start working on the other building and the other project I have in mind. So let's go ahead and start working on that too. Alright, that's everything I need. I'll grab some of that. And alright, that's good enough. Perfect. Alright, so let's go ahead and add some trap doors on the corners. Let's see if that works how I want it to work. Oh no, not really happy with that. Alright, so we're probably going to remove the trap doors. Let's see how it would look on the side. No, I don't like that. Actually, I'm pretty sure you can't. Maybe you can actually. Hold on. That doesn't look too good. Let me try this one more time. So I'm pretty sure I want the, all the trap doors to close in. And I have no idea why it's not right now. So we're not going to bother with the trap doors right now. I think we're going to stick away from that. But we can definitely use probably some frames. Can we put... No, frames doesn't look good either. Uh, let's go ahead and try some stairs. Maybe stairs is the best way to try this right now. Let me see. Probably put... No, that doesn't... Mm, that's okay. That's not too bad. Let's actually try this one more time like that. No, we're going to take those down. I'm still going to think this through. I'm not entirely sure. I want to make this look good as well. So uh, maybe possibly what we could do is just add, for example, just two fence posts on the corners so that the corners don't look just so empty. Maybe, yeah, maybe that's the way to go for now. And if you guys have any suggestions, do let me know in the comment sections. I definitely appreciate that. So we're still going to work on this. It's still not done. We're going to have to replicate it to other farms that we have around here. As you can see, there's one more down there. So we'll be working on that as well. But in the meantime, we're going to go ahead, add a little bit more details to the side. So I'm thinking we're going to have a cauldron um, right about, I guess, here is fine. Uh, let's go add it right there. So we're going to add some of those around here. We're, oh, gosh, what the heck? How did I fail that? That was... What is going on? Okay, there we go. We need that to go inside. That was an epic fail. So we're going to have those cauldrons over there uh, filled up with water around here. We're definitely going to have a lot of those. We do have our amazing little well over here that's fantastic to have around. All right, let's eat up a bit more. So that's looking great. As you guys can see, adding a bit more green to the desert definitely looks awesome. So now let me show you guys what I have in plan with this building. So down here, we are going to have two doors. So I'm going to make right now a crafting table, which surprisingly I have not made yet. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a crafting table. I want to make some doors. So we're going to go with some, I guess we'll just work with some oak or some jungle doors um, for now, temporary. Uh, but I like that. So if, actually, we're going to stick with jungle doors. That doesn't look too bad either. Um, and I do want one more thing to do, which is to kind of add an extruded area here. So let's get some, where is the sandstone? There we go. So sandstone is going to pretty much go around it like this. Now, I want to have some, so I guess we're going to get some sandstone stairs and slabs. And we're going to try to work out a quick design here. Something really simple. And I think it will look kind of cool. So let's go ahead and try this. And now we're going to add some slabs. I think we're going to have some slabs on top, possibly. Yeah, that's actually quite cool. I like that. That's really simple. And then we're going to have some glowstone on these sides. But that's pretty simple just for main entrance. But like I said, I do want to add more greenery around here. And that's why we're going to be working with a lot of uh, leaves and vines. Uh, so we're going to be doing a lot of that around here. So we're going to add a few on this wall. So you guys can kind of let them let the vines grow a bit. Here we go. And that's going to look pretty cool when it's all done. So it's going to be like a wall of vines on some areas. We definitely want to work with some uh, spruce wood as well for some support. And I was thinking they were, are actually going to go like this. So right where we have those pillars, they're going to be extended from the top. So we're definitely going to need some dirt again. So let's go block up. And actually, we're going to go all the way to the top. And by the way, down here, I'll show you, I actually cut out a few. So uh, I kind of made a little cutout in here. So we are going to be designing this in the next episode. But I just wanted to show you guys, this is going to be one of our bigger buildings and include including this one right across there. So let's go ahead and block up to the top. And I want to show you guys what I have in mind with the whole uh, jungle wood that we were just going to work on. And I think I'm not going to be able to make this park. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. <laughs> All right, there we go. And let's go back to the top. All right, perfect. So we're just going to go ahead, use the jungle wood we have, and we are going to continue doing the same style across. And how did I mess that up? All right, I don't know how I messed that up. There we go. We'll just keep going around. Good thing we have some vines, I guess. We'll just climb to the top place them same with this side that's not gonna work out too well let's see if we can get it there we go perfect so from this distance let's see how it looks 
Okay, that looks quite cool. I like that. So now we're going to have to add some fence posts. I think it would be kind of nice to have some fence posts supporting it or maybe stairs. Uh, let's go ahead and see how sandstone stairs would look if it were to be supporting it like that. That could be kind of cool, but actually, I don't even think we really need it. I think it would be fine enough if we leave it like this for now, and we'll replicate that on all sides. So let's go ahead and do the same on this side as well and see how that looks. I also want to show you how the top is going to look because that's what makes this whole design come to life. But it's definitely going to help having the jungle wood around here too. So we'll go ahead and keep doing that. How's, how's it going, villagers? We're making this place look pretty awesome. So I'm so ha I'm really happy with how this is turning out so far. Please let me know in the comment sections as well. So we're going to continue to do that. And there we go. So we have all the jungle wood done. Now we're going to pillar to the top. So I'm just going to go and block back up. Pillar to the top so I can show you what plans I have with the little gaps in here. Because we're not going to leave it like that. It's going to be changed. So what we're going to do is now we're going to go ahead and grab ourselves some uh, some slabs. And we're going to place some between every single little area we have right here. And actually we'll just do this so we don't fall down. And I think I put it on the bottom. So perfect. Oh actually it's not supposed to be... Uh, sandstone slabs it's going to be uh, spruce slabs and I think I have some spruce slabs on me there we go and that's why we have the fences as well and the gates so we're gonna be using this that's why I'm trying to work with some uh, darker colors because the jungle or the uh, sand biome is pretty light colors you know so working with some uh, wood will definitely you know make this look really really cool and you guys will see just exactly how it looks when it's all done right now and so far we're making progress for the first part of this uh project and now we're gonna add fences now let me see what i was no 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 we're not gonna work with actually we could do gates let's go see how gates would look so if we put gates right here that won't really work too well but it's from the side so i have to go from the top so let's see how that looks um no i'm not gonna work i'm gonna have the gates as windows i'm not gonna use glass in this world or in the jungle or in the uh desert biome we're just gonna call it the i guess the desert oasis uh, but there we go. We're just going to put fence posts. And then for windows, we'll use, uh, I guess we'll use uh, gates. And that I think will look really cool. So let's go around and do the same thing. Oh, we missed this spot. Here we go. And then that's perfect. So now up top here, this is the area where I kind of left it kind of empty. Because I was not entirely sure what I was going to do with the entrance. But now I guess it's the time to take a look at it and see how this looks as well from the distance. But so far, you guys will see what I'm talking about. This is really taking its uh, shape right now, and it's only been a few ep or just a f just a few little details to it from uh, from just a normal uh, des or desert biome uh, village. So you guys can do this yourselves. It's pretty easy. So it's really looking good. So check that out already. I think it's looking awesome. I really does look good. So let me see how it looks from this angle as well. Let's take a look quickly. Yeah, you know what? That looks pretty cool. And we're definitely gonna have uh, those. Uh, I guess those spruce slabs will have something under it as well, so it doesn't have that gap, but it doesn't look too bad like that either. All right, so making progress so far. Now, what I want to do for this entrance is, of course, we're going to have our door. So let's go ahead and place our door right there. Now we got to figure out how we're going to fill in this spot. I'm thinking for now we're just going to work with some stairs, probably do some type of design here where we might just put the... Let's go ahead and grab the dirt, go back to the top here place ourselves some sandstone let's see i think sandstone would be just fine there we go and then we'll just close it in like this which looks quite decent we'll get some stairs we'll put the stairs probably do that that actually looks quite cool and then uh let's see what else could we do let's go and add i'm thinking of just adding the fences like this and then on the top we'll have let's see we could oh i forgot we're gonna have to work with some jungle so we'll put some leaves around here too all right, there we go. So I think that's a decent entrance. This is not going to be like the main entrance, but I think that's pretty cool and simple for now. This will be some type of, uh, I guess, like a little patio we're going to have set up here. We're going to have to add some slabs. Uh, we're definitely going to work on that one uh, in the next episode. I still have to think that one through. But we definitely have our villagers here, which is really great. There are some librarians I spotted, so eventually we'll have to work on that. But looks like the villagers are enjoying this addition here. And look, some of them are even going inside. This is actually quite good. So we're going to be working on the flooring in here and changing it all up. But it's looking much better than what it is before. And I think the vision is coming to life right now for this oasis. Like, if you take a look from here... It's really starting to look cool. And uh, we're definitely going to be adding some more details. Like I said, uh, we're probably going to add some slabs and some more cauldrons around here. Uh, definitely a lot more leaves. So let's go ahead and probably put some leaves on the top. That's one thing I should have done. So let's go ahead and try to 
go to the top and see oh it's turning night but let's go ahead and see if i add maybe that will look too much i mean we can just give it a shot or we could try to put them on top of this oh that looks better okay so it is turning night but we're gonna quickly go and try this just from this side and see how it looks probably just go from all sides here and then we're gonna have uh sandstone slabs with like uh flower pots on them as well so i think that's gonna look cool but so far making progress and i think it's looking great all right let's go ahead and get some sleep but there we go that looks fantastic that's a better little addition to it but man this is looking great so we're gonna be getting close to the end of the episode it actually is the end of the episode today we've done a lot of progress so if you guys enjoyed today's uh episode make sure you go ahead and hit that like button let me know any feedback you have down below in the comment sections and that is pretty much it for today's episode like i said don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new and go ahead and hit that little bell next to that button so you guys are part of notification squad other than that thank you again uh for watching today's episode and i'll catch you guys next time with another another Minecraft server let's play. My name is Alex and peace out and stay foxy.